Hey what's going on guys this is Kedar here and here onto my PS4 I'm getting this error it says NAT type failed here you can see into my network setting NAT type is failed and I'm getting this error onto my PS4 while ideally you should get NAT type something like this so well guys today in this video we'll check out what this error is all about why it occurs and how can you possibly fix this one we got couple of methods to solve this issue so without further ado let's get right into it before we start this video make sure to hit that like share this video subscribe to our channel for more of such latest videos with that being said let's get right into it so in order to check whether there is any problem i headed over to the playstation network service status and looks like right now the all services are up and running so well, in that case you need to do following steps first well nat error is a network address translation this one translates your public ip address into private one and vice versa and in case of ps4 usually connecting to other ps4 device is not problematic but this issue may arise when you use the type 3 nat connection via router with no dmz setup or open ports in your router that will probably cause the ps4 nat type failed error so this is the reason why you are getting this one speaking of the possible thing first one you can try you can perform manual configuration on your ps4 network settings so let me show you what you can do this one is causing due to incorrect configuration of ps4 network setting so first you need to go into your network settings and here you need to find your ip address right over here you can simply head over to the ps4 settings into the network tab and into the view connection status right over here you can see the ip address then you need to head on to your desktop right click on to the start menu right over here and from there pick the command prompt once you open up your command prompt copy this command this command is called ip conflict slash all and what this command will do it will show you all your ip configuration once you put this command just press enter then here you need to note the following things things like ip address default gateway dns server and subnet mask now take note of now take note of all of these four parameters for your particular network then move over to your ps4 and we are going to change few things go to the network and set up internet connections right over here you can see then you can simply use wi-fi or your ethernet lan setup both will work fine so no worries and once you choose any one of them you need to choose the custom setup this one right over here and once you do that you need to input the network details that we have noted into our windows and make sure guys do not set up with the proxy server this is gonna ruin your internet so simply do not use the proxy server now wait for the internet settings to update and then after the internet settings are updated you can simply click over here onto the the test internet connection and now here you'll get your ps4 internet connection nat type and here you can see the nat type is instead of getting nat type filled now we are getting nat type 2 so there it is guys that's one way how you can fix it speaking of the second method you can enable universal plug and play for your router this one stands for upnp universal plug and play this one helps your network to find the thing and connect with each other in order to enable upnp on your router now this might change as per your router vendor here the tp link router example is being shown so first you need to head over to your router page then you know put your username password and login and then here you can see guys into the advanced tab here we got option for forward and and right over here you can see there is an option for upnp just need to enable this upnp and then you need to apply and save your settings then you need to turn off the router and reboot it again and wait till it connects properly and after the router is successfully turned on open your ps4 settings and then boom you can see guys our nat type is successfully showing type 1 or either type 2 rather than showing nat type failed if this method doesn't work for you you can set your ps4 as a dmz server so same thing you need to head over to your router page and then here into the forwarding there is an option for current dmz status you need to enable this one then select enable dmz status now here you need to match the ip address with your ps4 ip address if your router is having nat filtering select the nat filtering option right over here and then apply and save the settings then when you check the ps4 settings the network settings you can see guys upon test 
testing the internet connection, it shows NAT type 1 or 2 and that's the success. If this still doesn't work for you, you can try the port method. Try port forwarding on your PS4. So select the IP address, password and username of your router and go to your browser, put the IP address and press just enter. Log in with your router page and then navigate to your port section and then try the port forwarding. Now here guys, you can use recommended ports like 80 or you can use 3478, either 3480, 443 or probably 3479. So make note of this ports. You can choose any one of them and see which one works better for you. Apply the changes and save them and hopefully any one of this method should fix your NAT type failed error on PS4. Now the thing is guys, as I was checking the PlayStation Network on down detector, many users are reporting there is an outage. So that might be the reason why you are getting this NAT type failed on your PS4. And let me refresh the PlayStation Network and here you can see this is status.playstation.com but the thing is it's totally weird all services are up and running as per the playstation network but the down detector let me rephrase the page it clearly says playstation network is facing the server connection issues right now you can try this methods i showed you already but as of right now i can see guys many people are getting like this warzone error 273472 and that's the reason many people are reporting psn servers are down and things like that so there it is guys i hope this video was helpful so make sure to hit that like subscribe to our channel for more of such awesome fixes share this video with your friends and this is kedar from how to guys signing out